we're beginning with a shorter version of the first part of the service. Alleluia, Christ is risen. He, he is, is risen, risen indeed. indeed. Alleluia. Alleluia. We'll say the Easter anthem. Christ, our Passover, has been sacrificed for us. So let us celebrate the feast, not with the old leaven of corruption and wickedness, but with the unleavened bread of sincerity and truth. Christ, once raised from the dead, dies no more. Death has no more dominion over him. In dying he died to sin once for all. In living he lives to God. See yourselves, therefore, as dead to sin and alive to God in Jesus Christ our Lord. Christ has been raised from the dead, the first fruits of those who sleep. For as by man came death, by man has come also the resurrection of the dead. For as in Adam all die, even so in Christ shall all be made alive. Glory to the Father, and, and to the, the Son, Son, and to the Holy Spirit, Spirit as, as it was, was in the beginning, beginning is now, now and, and shall be forever. forever. Amen. Amen. The Collect for Easter Day. Lord of all life and power, who through the mighty resurrection of your Son overcame the old order of sin and death to make all things new in him, grant that we, being dead to sin and alive to you in Jesus Christ, may reign with him in glory, to whom with you and the Holy Spirit we praise and honour, glory and might, now and in all eternity. Amen. Amen. A shortened version of the Gospel. Early on the first day of the week, while it was still dark, Mary Magdalene came to the tomb and saw the stone had been removed from the tomb. So she ran and went to Simon Peter and the other disciple, the one whom Jesus loved, and said to them, they have taken the Lord out of the tomb, and we do not know where they have laid him. Then Peter and the other disciple set out and went towards the tomb. The two were running together, but the other disciple outran Peter and reached the tomb first. He bent down to look in and saw the linen wrappings lying there, but he did not go in. Then Simon Peter came, following him, and went into the tomb. He saw the linen wrappings lying there, and the cloth that had been on Jesus' head, not lying with the linen wrappings, but rolled up in a place by itself. Then the other disciple, who reached the tomb first, went in, and he saw and believed, for as yet they did not understand the scripture, that he must rise from the dead. Then the disciples returned to their home. This is the Gospel of the Lord. Praise, Praise to, to you, you, O Christ. It's traditional that at Easter we renew our baptism promises, remembering that in baptism we die to sin and rise to new life. We're united with Christ's resurrection. I invite you to join in making the responses as we go through. Do you reject the devil and all rebellion against God? I, I reject, reject them. them. Do you renounce the deceit and corruption of evil? I renounce, I renounce them. them. Do you repent of the sins that separate us from God and our neighbour? I, I repent of them. them. Do you turn to Christ as Saviour? I turn, I turn to, to Christ. Christ. Do you submit to Christ as Lord? I, I submit, submit to Christ. Christ. Do you come to Christ the way, the truth and the life? I come, come to, to Christ. Christ. The response is, we believe and trust in him. Do you believe and trust in God the Father, source of all being and life, the one for whom we exist? We, we believe, believe and, and trust, trust in, in him. him. Do you believe and trust in God the Son, who took our human nature, died for us and rose again? We believe and, and trust, trust in him. him. Do you believe and trust in God the Holy Spirit, 
who gives life to the people of God and makes Christ known in the world. We, we believe, believe and trust in him. him. This is the faith of the <laughs> church. This, this is, is our faith. faith. We, we believe, believe and trust in one God, God Father, Father, Son and Christ. Holy Spirit. Amen. Almighty God, we thank you for our fellowship in the household of faith with all those who have been baptised in your name. Keep us faithful to our baptism, and so make us ready for that day when the whole creation <coughs> shall be made perfect in your Son, our Saviour Jesus Christ. Amen. Amen. The risen Lord came and stood among his disciples and said, Peace be with you. Then were they glad when they saw the Lord. Alleluia! The peace of the risen Lord be always with you. And also, also with, with you. you. Alleluia. Bless you, Lord God of all creation. Of your goodness we have this bread to offer, which earth has given and human hands have made. It will become for us the bread of life. Blessed be God forever. forever. Blessed you, Lord God of all creation, of your goodness we have this wine to offer, fruit of the vine and work of human hands. It will become for us the cup of salvation. Blessed, Blessed be, be God, God forever. forever. The Lord is here. His the Spirit, Spirit is, is with us. us. Lift up your hearts. We, we lift, lift them, them to the Lord. Lord. Let us give thanks to the Lord our God. It is right to give thanks and praise. You are worthy of our thanks and praise, Lord God of truth, for by the breath of your mouth you have spoken your word, and all things have come into being. You fashion us in your image and place us in the garden of your delight. <clears throat> Though he chose the path of rebellion, you would not abandon your own. Again and again you drew us into your covenant of grace. You gave your people the law and taught us by your prophets to look for your reign of justice, mercy and peace. As we watch for the signs of your kingdom on earth, we echo the song of the angels in heaven, evermore praising you and saying, Holy, 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 holy Lord, God of power and might, heaven and earth are full of your glory. Hosanna in the highest. Blessed is he who comes in the name of the Lord. Hosanna in the highest. Lord God, you are the most holy one, enthroned in splendour and light. Yet in the coming of your Son, Jesus Christ, you reveal the power of your love, made perfect in our human weakness. Embracing our humanity, Jesus showed us the way of salvation, loving us to the end. He gave himself to death for us, dying for his own. He set us free from the bonds of sin, that we might rise and reign with glory. On the night he gave up himself for us all, he took bread and gave you thanks. He broke it and gave it to his disciples, saying, Take, eat, this is my body which is given for you. Do this in remembrance of me. In the same way after supper he took the cup and gave you thanks. He gave it to them saying, drink this all of you. This is my blood of the new covenant which is shed for you and for many for the forgiveness of sins. Do this as often as you drink it in remembrance of me. Therefore we proclaim the death that he suffered on the cross. We celebrate his resurrection, his bursting from the tomb. We rejoice that he reigns at your right hand on high, and we long for his coming in glory. As we recall the one perfect sacrifice of our redemption, Father, let you, by your Holy Spirit, let these gifts of your creation Be for us the body and blood of our Lord Jesus Christ. 
Form us into the likeness of Christ and make us a perfect offering in your sight. Look with favour on your people and in your mercy hear the cry of our hearts. Bless the earth, heal the sick, let the oppressed go free and fill the church, your church with power from on high. Gather your people from the ends of the earth to feast with all your saints at the table in your kingdom where the new creation is brought to perfection in Jesus Christ our Lord, by whom and with whom and in whom, in the unity of the Holy Spirit, all honour and glory be yours, Almighty Father, for ever and ever. Amen. We say the Lord's Prayer together. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name, thy kingdom come, Thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. For thine is the kingdom, the power and the glory forever and ever. Amen. We break this bread to share in the body of Christ. Though we are many, we are one body, because we all share in one bread. Jesus, Lamb of God, have mercy on us. Jesus, bearer of our sins, have mercy on us. Jesus, Redeemer of the world, grant us peace. Alleluia, Christ, our Passover is sacrificed for us. Therefore, let us keep the feast. Alleluia. As I share in this communion, I do so on behalf of all those who'd like to take communion this Easter, but are presented to from my circumstances. gave your only begotten Son to the death of the cross and by his glorious resurrection have delivered us from the power of our enemy. Grant us so to die daily to sin that we may evermore live with him in the joy of his risen life. Through Jesus Christ our Lord. Amen. Amen. The God of peace who brought again from the dead our Lord Jesus that great shepherd of the sheep, through the blood of the eternal covenant, make you perfect in every good work to do his will, working in you that which is well-pleasing in his sight. And the blessing of God Almighty, the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit, be upon you and remain with you, now and always. Amen. Amen. Can I just say that 
apologise once again for our problems with the sound earlier on. We shall put the sermon, the text of the sermon and the full readings on the Facebook page so you can follow them or not, which is not an offer you get often with a sermon. Can I take this opportunity of wishing you all a very happy and blessed Easter. Happy Easter.